In Health Source this morning, if you're diagnosed with kidney cancer early, you have an excellent chance of a cure. But if your doctor finds the tumor later, you may be facing a much tougher fight. Now a doctor at Riverside Hospital is testing a new drug, one that could offer a new way to help. 10TV's Kurt Ludlow has more. Mark Lambert comes to Riverside Hospital from Wilmington for a CAT scan. He was diagnosed with kidney cancer after his doc found it by accident. Family doctor ordered a test because I'm a diabetic just to check kidney function. Had no idea. There was no symptoms or anything. Just, it was very shocking. Dr. Wayne Pohl removed Mark's left kidney. He wanted to keep the cancer from coming back, a problem for many patients whose tumors are large. Right now the standard of care is nothing. There is no drug that's approved to help prevent recurrence because the drugs are so toxic. Other cancers can be held at bay with traditional treatments, but not this one. Kidney cancer is really resistant to conventional chemotherapies. So he suggested that Mark join a clinical trial for a new drug with no side effects. It's designed to kill off cancer cells, as well as ramp up the body's immune system to destroy the cancer. A recurrence could be fatal. You can really forget the chance of ever feeling that I've been cured. So there's great, great value, if it's possible, in giving something up front that may help decrease recurrence rates. Mark doesn't know if he's gotten the trial drug, but he likes the thought of helping other people as well as himself. It was a win-win situation all the way around as far as I'm concerned. Kurt Ludlow, 10TV News. And it'll be several years before researchers know whether if this trial drug works the way they hope it will, 54,000 Americans will be diagnosed with kidney cancer this year alone.